Your favorite hardcore show coming live and direct. Masters of Hardcore Mayhem. The Masters of Hardcore! You're listening to Masters of Hardcore Mayhem, your monthly dose of hardcore. You're tuned into Masters of Hardcore Mayhem. Good evening, hardcore heads, and welcome to the third episode of Masters of Hardcore Mayhem. Thank you so much to everyone that tuned into episode one and episode two. We're happy we're back again. And tonight we have quite an awesome episode because I'm joined by two very happy guys. Definitely, we have definitely. Restyle over here and Krypton over here. Hi, Dara. I'm super excited to have you guys in here tonight. Likewise, likewise. Very good to be here. Nice evening, everyone. And again, it's a world premiere because these guys have never performed together. Nope. Nope. <laughs> so I'm very curious to see how never you guys ever. will be mixing together because you make French core, more or less. Kind of. And you're kind of like a bit hardcore, happy hardcore, a little bit of everything. A little bit uh, in between everything. Yeah. 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 So I'm really curious to see what's going to happen here at the decks at the Master of Hardcore Studio. So yeah, what do you guys say? Let's get into the music Perfect. and let's see what let's happens. Let's go. Let's go. Very good idea. Awesome. Your favorite hardcore show, coming live and direct. Masters of Hardcore Mayhem. The Masters of Hardcore! You're listening to Masters of Hardcore Mayhem. Your monthly dose of hardcore. You're tuned into Masters of Hardcore Mayhem.
I'm here. We're live. We're live. Right. Perfect, We're perfect. live. Yeah. Hello, Des Masters. Des <laughs> that was uh, very spontaneous. Uh, thank you, everyone, for tuning in. And thank you, everyone, for waiting. Thanks. Sorry about the technical difficulties. Turns out we started the stream and then nothing was happening. Uh, now it is. Now, now it, it is. is. It's working. <laughs> so perfect, we're here perfect. and it's working. And tonight is an extra special episode. It's episode three of Master Parkour Mayhem. And I'm joined by two awesome guys. I have Restyle over here. And I have Krypton I do, over here. I do. And once again, it's very exclusive because these two guys have never performed together. Nope. Never. Never ever. Are you guys nervous? Totally not. I'm no. shaking, I'm shaking. No, no, no worries. No I feel worries. like Restyle looks a bit nervous. Yeah. yeah. No, <laughs> I, I really can't wait uh, to uh, to play some uh, some uh, up tempo set. An up tempo <laughs> set? Yeah, no, not up tempo hardcore, but uh, up in the tempo. I mean. Let's do this. Let's do this. <laughs> I thought I was gonna hear some happy music. Of course, of course. Of course. Yeah. Goodbye. I brought some up happy tempo music. Tempo is also fine by me. <laughs> Okay, let's go. All right, so guys, let's get stuck into the mix. And once again, everyone, thank you for tuning in to Masters of Hardcore Mayhem. Together, we are Masters of Hardcore.
strange variables of human life and make something out of a crazy quilt that saves hundreds of lives.
Masters of Hardcore, bringing you the mayhem. of hardcore mayhem.
city to city, all around the world. Hard style is in our DNA, and it will never fade away.
wanna be face to face
Thank you. Nice. Thank you. I, I think they myself. need a round of applause. <laughs> nice one, guys. Once again, thank you so much for joining me for Master of Hardcore Mayhem Episode 3. As I said like four times already, I'm so happy you guys are here. This is fucking awesome. And yeah, I couldn't think of two better people to put behind the decks together. Yeah, d- it was uh, funny. It was a uh, funny set. It was really fun to do. Some uh, yeah. quick mixing. Uh, it was f- uh, faster than I play normally, but uh, I, l- I like the tool. Yeah. Actually. And do you, do you have to like put up the BPM of your tracks? Just a little. Just a little bit. Just okay. a little like, bit more. Just yeah. a little bit. He has to go a bit higher. I have to go a little bit lower, and then we can uh, yeah. can find like the good balance. Yeah. That should be fine. Yeah. Fun fact is when uh, the two guys showed up at our studio, they didn't really know that they were going to perform together. Nope. Definitely. <laughs> no. I thought we were going to both do a solo set, but uh, this is fun. This is fun. Yeah, it's fun. It's master of har- masters of hardcore dropping bombs. That's what we do. Um, so yeah, 2019 kind of showed up and disappeared. I mean, the summer is over, but it's been nonetheless an awesome year. How have you 
been this year? Like, what what have you been up to, music-wise? Yeah, it, it was a very busy year in the in the studio. I uh, I didn't saw much uh, sunlight <laughs> this year. Uh, <laughs> actually, today as well, but uh, it it was worth it. Had some uh, had some great gigs as well in the festival season, and some good releases. I I can't complain, and I'm uh, already. Uh, preparing for next year for a lot more new tracks as well. Awesome. And Crypto, what about you? How has 2019 been treating you? It's been kind of a rush, kind of everything happening so fast. And uh, well, I can't complain really. Seriously, yeah, it's uh, awesome to see what's happening like last year. Nice. And what's your like highlights been so far? My kind of year was kind of full of highlights, so I really don't know. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> no, no, no. It's just seriously been full of highlights. Like every weekend was like a blast. Good to hear. All right, so we have some questions. Uh, Restyle, you've yeah. been in the hardcore scene for a really long time, actually. Yeah, I, I think it's uh, 18 years now. 18. Yeah, yeah okay. I, 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 he's out. He's out. <laughs> I'm, I'm old. He's saying he's old, and I am. I am. I am. I am. Okay, I have peace with it. But uh, I, I signed in 2003 at Masters of Hardcore, so that's been uh, quite a while. I, w I was 13, I think. 13? Yeah, I was 13 years old. That's insane. 13. And uh, the, there's uh, changed a lot during the years, but not in a, in a negative way, I think. It's uh, it's, it's growing up, the scene, still. Yeah. Every, every year uh, y you see uh, a lot of uh, things happening. Yeah, and what have been <laughs> the biggest changes in the hardcore scene for you? For me, the biggest yeah. change in the hardcore scene? Yeah. Uh, yeah, the, the the hardcore scene, the, you mean the music, I think? Everything, the music or the culture yeah. or the parties, anything. Yeah, the, the, the hardcore music is, is, is changing a lot. Not, not only one time in, in since I was here, it's, it's changing once in a year or five, I think. Yeah. And uh, when I started, the, the, the BPM was a lot lower. Even lower than hardstyle now, I think. It, it, uh, yeah. And and during the years, it, it, then it it gets more aggressive, then it gets faster. But uh, I think that's good. I think it's it's uh, good uh, a good genre that is uh, have its evolution. Yeah. yeah. And of course, it's very it's become very diverse. You have like you know the kind of mainstream main stage hardcore. Yeah. You have French core. You have up tempo. You have terror. You have kind of everything nowadays. And maybe back in the days, there wasn't as much to choose from not uh, not so much no indeed y y you had uh, i think two or three uh, sub genres and now uh, i think it was you you had early rave industrial and mainstream hardcore yeah back in the days and nowadays it are more or less uh, five or six i think yeah. but, but, uh, <laughs> that, that, that's good that's good i mean if you go to massive hardcore or dominator there's like several different stages where yeah. you can hear like all different types of hardcore and we have Next generation over here, Krypton. Thanks. So how long have you been uh, like in the hardcore scene for? When did you start out? I think it's been like two, three years. Not that long, actually. Okay. And is that when you started producing or just when no, you started? No, I think I started producing like producing music like seven, eight years ago. Okay. I started off with doing everything, just fooling around. Most of the time I made like hard cell and I made hard cell uh, just till I got in touch with the hardcore scene like three years ago oh okay and what what made you want to produce french core well i kind of always was fooling around sometimes i was making dubstep sometimes i was making house music i don't know and then i got in touch with the french core kind of sound and it felt well i could uh, do whatever i want and it felt good cool very nice and you guys have actually worked in the studio together yep this yep. year you released a track hate me how is it to work together it actually went kind of good. He works in the same program as me. Uh, the workflow was kind of the same, so I didn't struggle with uh, many things, actually. And you? <laughs> no comment. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't struggling either. <laughs> but uh, I liked it a lot, actually. Yeah, yeah. You, uh, you don't see that a lot, uh, that uh, producers have uh, yeah, such good vibes, uh, such uh, happy happy notes, happy melodies yeah. in, in, in their tracks. <laughs> and, and that's what I liked a lot about his style. 
and it was actually a, a demo of him that we uh, started to work on. It kind of funny story. It, it, it was an old uh, demo, and I, I said, we need to finish this right now. <laughs> and, uh, and then I started working, he, he, he uh, was coming over to my place, and we worked one day, I think, and then... It was kind of finished. It was kind of finished. It, it was uh, we were working in like ten hours straight, I think. Oh really? Something like that. No. Wow. And seeing as you guys worked so well on Hate Me, is there plans to do another collaboration in the future? The plans are going on for like uh, three or four months already, but oh, okay. <laughs> we still didn't get to do anything. Yeah, but we, we had uh, like five or six uh, demos. Kind of. And uh, and then uh, yeah, the thing you need to do is uh, choose the best one. To, yeah. uh, to work on and I think we we found a good one now so I think this Should year or maybe in January yeah. you will hear it and so when you guys go to this well when you go to the studio together do you kind of like prepare something at home bring yeah, it with you I, I always like to uh, have something to start off with so like a melody or cool vocals or something like that mm -hmm. so or uh, Matthijs or me uh, just uh, have something cool in mind. I write it down, just send it over to him. And when something fits, we can go actually visit each other to finish it. So uh, I don't like to start off with like a blank uh, schedule. Yeah. So yeah. ladies and gentlemen, that's how collaborations work. I think so. Learned a lesson today. And uh, what are you guys like both working on in the studio uh, in terms of your solo releases? Um like the last couple of weeks i really tried to focus on some solo works like the last couple of tracks like four tracks i think were collaborations so i now uh, just want to focus on uh, a few good solo tracks so i um, actually finished one i played it like uh, this set oh yeah yeah you posted something on your social media that yeah. you're going to premiere a new track yeah new solo track Very indeed nice. uh, i've got like two or three demos laying around um, waiting to be finished okay so they will work out and one of them probably is getting released really soon so sounds awesome yeah what about you restyle i i have uh, like two or three new tracks finished but I'm not going to play them tonight. I, uh, I'm waiting until Syndicate uh, this Saturday, oh, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah. What I can say about the tracks is that it's, uh, it's just uh, the same style, the same restyle. The same restyle? Yeah. Oh, I like <laughs> it. That's very smooth. Yeah. So then you know what you can uh, expect. So you've got to be at Syndicate to hear Restyle's new tracks. Yep. Awesome. And what do you say we get stuck back into the music? Let you two do your thing. Good idea. We, uh, Jam it out. We let's still go. need to play uh, the, the collab uh, Hit Me, so... Uh, let's go. Oh yeah, let's do it, guys. Let's do it.
The spring is mellow. Is the spring rustling in the trees? Fill my heart with delight. Prepare of all kind. Sceneries which fulfill my soul. Which will tranquilly last forever in my mind.
came to see of Hardcore, bringing you the mayhem. Together, we are masters of hardcore. To the sellouts, one way up. To the sellouts, here we go, turn it up. Uh. To the sellouts, one way up. To the sellouts, turn it up, don't stop. dose of hardcore.
Masters of Hardcore, bringing you the mayhem. The system is designed to create dependency. It's so much easier to control those who need. Despite faithfully feeding this hypnotizing system, feed our souls. Follow our dreams. Strike this root chord of a new scale. 
Masters of Hardcore Mayhem. dose of hardcore. Masters of Hardcore, bringing you the mayhem.
agradeciendo para todos los bailadores con esta rola que dice... Un, dos, tres, cuatro. Guys, that was fucking amazing. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. What was the track that you just closed with? Uh, it's kind of... Um, Untos, Tras, oh, it's called Capo? El, Son El Sonidito. <laughs> like a DJ tool of El Sonidito. It's like a weird Spanish track. And is it your DJ tool? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's great. I loved it. Thanks. <laughs> Should definitely release it. I'm definitely not. <laughs> <laughs> Did you guys enjoy performing together? Yes, of course. Nice. Yeah. Have to see you up on stage again. Yeah. Let's do this. Let's do it. Great. All right. Well, thank you everyone for tuning into the third episode of Masters of Hardcore. Thanks Mayhem. for watching. Thanks. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. Uh, this episode will also be available on Spotify, on iTunes, on SoundCloud, and you can watch the stream again if you're a diehard and love this episode so much. My name is Cassie. I have Freestyle and Krypton. Thank you guys again for joining. Your favorite hardcore show coming live and direct. direct. Masters of Hardcore Mayhem. The Masters of Hardcore! You're listening to Masters of Hardcore Mayhem, your monthly dose of hardcore. You're tuned into Masters of Hardcore Mayhem.